Hello, welcome to my channel. You are here because you are interested to study in Germany, right? Yes, tama ako. In this video, we will be talking about enrollment. Last step na siya. But before kayo mag-enroll, kailangan nyo muna ng admission certificate and student visa. I made a series of video from applying in German university and securing admission offer. And of course, how to apply a student visa in Germany. And this is the last step enrollment i'm gonna put all the links in the description box down below you might as well want to check it but before anything else good morning i hope you are doing fine if bago ka dito sa channel ko my name is rowi i'm studying here in germany and today we will be talking about enrollment kapag meron ka na admission offer sa german university and nakapag apply ka na ng visa and kapag nandito ka na sa germany ito na yung last step bago ka mag start ng university enrollment it doesn't mean na kapag meron ka ng visa is you are already enrolled no, you still have to enroll. Normally, kapag mag-start ka ng university, in my case ha, in my case, I don't know sa ibang university. If I remember it right, bibigyan kayo ng checklist. Ang mga checklist is bank account, kasi in my case, it's a private university. Ang pagbayad ng tuition is direct debit. And kailangan mo ding mag-register sa munisipyo. Ilalagay mo doon yung address mo kung saan ka nakatira. And then, kailangan mo ding pirmahan yung contract. Uh, in my case, meron kaming contract sa, sa university. Mga rules and regulations ng university. So, kailangan mo permahan yon. And then, ano pa ba? Insurance. Yung insurance policy mo, kailangan mong i-submit sa kanila. And kapag nakumpleto mo na yung checklist, bibigyan ka na ng student number and student ID. Yung student ID na yun is also valid for public transportation. Called it semester ticket. So, kailangan mong ingatan at huwag mong iwawala kasi yun yung ticket mo kapag sasakay ka ng public transportation, uh, na, mga buses, trains, or tram. So, dapat parati mo siyang dadalahin. Kasi pag na-check ka at wala akang semester ticket, then you have to find. Depende kung magkano ang penalty, depende kung sa ang city ka. So, less complicated na ang enrollment kasi mag a ka lang ng orientation and kailangan mo lang i- i-provide yung mga documents na kailangan nila like registration and insurance number uh, contract and that's it then you are enrolled and then the last thing is bibigyan ka nila ng online access sa university portal dun mo makikita yung mga timetable mo sa buong semester and that's it kailangan mo lang i-fulfill yung mga documents na kailangan nila sa'yo like yung nasabi ko nga address insurance and kailangan mong permahan yung contract ng university and yung mga rules and regulations kailangan mong alamin and then kailangan mo lang ng access sa university website para sa mga updates sa timetable mo and then you are ready to start so yun lang aking experience upon enrollment I don't know kung ano yung enrollment process ng ibang university but ever na meron mang difference konti lang siguro baka kailangan lang nila ng extra documents or something you just have to register and uh, tell them that you are already here in Germany <laughs> and yeah so ano pa ba so that's it and I wish you all the luck kaya nyo yan and yeah and I'll see you again next time. Bye-bye.